Thanks for staying with us. Happening right now in San Benito County, a big crab feed. The annual event is a fundraiser for the community. Action News 8 reporter Leslie Duarte is live in Tres Pinos at the event. Leslie, how's it looking out there? Ari, things are just getting started here. We are at the 32nd annual Old Fashioned Crab Crack and Dance. And take a look. This is the first time it's back since the pandemic. But look, they have a silent auction. They have live music. They also have lots of food. The main ingredient on tonight's dish is crab. But hey, it's not all about the good food tonight. It's also for a good cause. And joining me tonight, we have Mike Baldwin. He is a volunteer and a crab tonight too. Mike is a volunteer for the Exchange Club of Hollister. And hey, you guys put this event together, but what is it all about? Well, tonight it's not about Everybody's being here is a great thing, but it's about the youth of the community. The Hollister Exchange Club has been around since 1926. It is the oldest exchange club in the west of the Mississippi. And we're here to raise money for the children of the community. What we do is we do several events like this throughout the year. And we raise, well, tonight we'll raise up to $20,000 for the community. But the money stays local here. Even though the Exchange Club is a national organization, we get to keep the money local. And with that, the youth that you see over here, sometimes they get some of the money. We do scholarships, we do grants. Um, we're active at the uh, fair and FFA and 4-H and CASA and any child that needs money, they can come. We make them present to us so that they get the experience in public speaking. We love to give out money. And this I event is one of them that allows us to do that. I love that, Mike. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, we are here till 11 p.m. tonight. The event has raised about $20,000 for local charities, youth charities. And I'm live in Tres Pinos, Leslie Duarte, KSPW Action News 8.